welcome this is energy vibration reading for the cancer sun moon and rising sign for the fourth week of august i want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back thank you for the wonderful positive energy it is a good week for you cancers because you're vibrating in the energy vibration of water week the zodiac energy from monday until wednesday is going to be fire and from thursday until sunday it's going to be um, earth so you have fire and her zodiac energy with your own um, the weak energy is the energy of water so this is going to be good we begins from the 26th 20th until the 26th and it is the fourth week please go back and listen to the monthly readings I want to say thank you so much to you cancers so so much thank you for hitting the thousand um, in a week mark and this is going to be good for you cancers because you're really really eating the thousand mark in this week so this is wonderful this is positive I'm seeing a beautiful layout you have the energy of hurt on Monday on Tuesday you have the energy of um, the wheel of fortune which is a positive energy and then on Wednesday you have the ace of cups so new love is coming in this could be the new birth of a child energy of the magician and energy of the ace of cups this could also be um, a spont spontaneous relationship news is coming in news is coming in about new love news is coming in about new love people from the past um, uh, for you cancers it could be um, past life um, relationships are coming back so you could be meeting someone who you have known in past life nine of Pentacles or eight of Pentacles eight of Pentacles is here so um, there is going to be a situation to balance out at your work some of you could be um, be offered a new job um, and this is going to be good um, because this new job is going to bring some balance in your life your um, work um, some of you could be offered a new promotion also so this is going to be good a lot of people are going to be connecting and working with people the weekend is um, one of magical happenings in um, some of you could be meeting a new love meeting someone new this person is um, a soul connection have a soul connection with you so you it's, it could be as if I really just care about this person I love this person you know whatever the situation is this is a soul connection and then we have the ace of cups and the three of Pentacles so um, this is good because whoever you are meeting um, there's going to be a lot of text message um, coming um, two and four um, from each other a lot of text message a lot of communication um, whoever um, a lot of communication whether it is uh, verbal communication uh whatever the communication is there's going to be a lot of communication with you and this new love that is coming in your life okay um work um you need to balance out work and your and uh, your private life work and um your private life needs to be balanced out that's um what is coming up here the wheel of fortune is going to bring you someone who is make, going to make your world uh, it, it, number one this person is going to make your heart flutter and it's going to open up your world to something beautiful um, you're going to um, um, you know feel loved as if you have never felt before okay so um, whoever you are out there now enjoy because while it lasts because it's as if it's going to be coming in now um, so enjoy it while it lasts okay so let's um, basically um, look at this week for you guys at work balance balance out situation some of you could be receiving an offer a new promotion or some of you um, could be connecting with um, um, past life uh, people from your past life coming in on the work floor so new people could be coming in and you could be connecting with this person um, and this is very positive because this is someone from a past life that you're going to be working on karma way okay the connection is going to be beautiful it's going to be a very beautiful connection and this connection could turn into a love affair or a love that will last for quite a like a long time because the energy of the magician and a wheel of fortune is here with the ace of cups so um, it could be some of you unexpectedly realize that you are pregnant and you, um, it's uh, too far gone you can't make, take an abortion it's on um, so it's the spirit that comes in 
and some of you could be um, always taking abortion and now you've realized that you're pregnant and it's too far gone so you have to have this ch this child so whatever it is you're gonna be working together with whoever the, the, the father of the child is or uh, whoever you have gotten pregnant you're going to be working together there is going to be communications um, from each other um, to resolve whatever that is going on okay so this is going to be good let's see what is happening for some of you could be c connected with someone who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius this person is a past life uh, um, connection um, it could be up the work floor or you're meeting this person at work or um, you're going to decide to work with this person on a project okay um, but this person you have known from lifetime and lifetimes and they want to um, collaborate with you on a project or um, this is someone who is coming in new at your work and you're going to be connecting with this person it can be a man or a woman um, in this because um, it is an, an, an general energy so it could be a man or a woman so you could be a man or a woman or this person could be a man or a woman okay some of you are going to be connecting with this person on the work floor uh, or in whatever way but that has to do with work you're going to be connecting with this uh, person and this person is between the age of 15 and 40 who you're going to be connecting with now um, in love we have here the energy of challenges in the reverse okay so whoever you are that was having some challenges with someone if you were married to an Aries Leo or Sagittarius and you were having some challenges with this person these challenges are going to come to an end because it's as if you're going to be meeting someone new it's as if the universe is removing these challenges out of your life it's as if you had a very challenging relationship with this person and you're going to decide that hey this is not the person for me and you're going to secretly look for someone or someone the universe your guides and angel is going to orchestrate and meet that you meet someone who is much better for this person then we have new love another ace of um, cups coming in so we have twice the ace of cups so it's all about love so a lot of you um, are going to be meeting a new um, and having new love affairs or meeting if you weren't looking for a relationship this is the week that you're going to be meeting new love coming in a lot of pregnancy a lot of people are going to find out that they are pregnant or that their partners are pregnant okay so be aware of this whoever you are out there a lot of you are going to be finding out that you are pregnant or your partner or pregnant because this uh, you know are going to be expecting because this is so vibrant in this week this is and twice the ace of cups coming up is a lot of new love and a lot of babies it could be babies that is being born or it could be that you're finding out that you are pregnant or your partner is pregnant so be aware of this some of you who are in a relationships um, with and uh, Aries Leo or Sagittarius person you are going to basically end this relationship you are going to be connecting with someone um, you're going to be connecting with someone else you're going to be meeting someone new and you're going to be connecting with someone else and uh, the situation is that you're finally um, seeing the truth of this person you're realizing that you don't really connect with this person so if this person is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius you're going to really decide that yeah this is not a relationship for me I have been trying to work on this relationship is a karmatic relationship It's a relationship that comes in your life to heal a situation and it's as if the universe is letting you see look this person is not right for you there has been so many challenges and this person is a very challenging person and they are going to be orchestrating a new um, someone new for you they're going to be orchestrating someone new for you so expect to um, meet someone new if even you're married or you're in a relationship and it's not as if you're looking for this person it's as if the universe is going to orchestrate this meet so you can meet this person and what is going to happen is that for the people who are married to this 
Aries Leo or Sagittarius you are going to release yourself from this challenge you don't need to be divorced or separated but because of this new love that is coming in um, the the challenges with your partner is going to be less the challenges with your partner is going to be less it's as if you're going to think okay whatever um, you're going to be going on late because you're going to spend in more time with this new person um, and some of you are going to be realizing that um, the, the the relationship or your partner um, that you're married to is pregnant and you want to end this relationship so you could start a new relationship and you're going to realize shit <laughs> she's pregnant or he's pregnant or he has got me pregnant and I want to end this relationship but um, whatever it is it's going to be um, a week where you really 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 are going to be meeting um, it's not really a soulmate or a twin flame it's just someone of a past life um, that the universe is going to orchestrate because here is a magician orchestrating this new meet because they want to get rid they want you to get rid of this person whoever this person is it's not very healthy for you now we have the energy of the two of swords the energy of the two of swords is that some of you are seeing a situation for what is is some of you who are married to an Aries Leo or Sagittarius is deciding to end the relationship or deciding to move away from the relationship or decided to make a decision that you know you're not going to let this person influence you anymore because um, you know you have met someone and this person who you have met uh, makes you feel good and made you know and um, you're going to decide that there's going to be a lot of arguments I can see a lot of arguments I can see some of you who are in a new relationship with someone there's a lot of arguments too but yet still there's a lot of information and connection and um, you know text messages and all of that it's all about love um, with this new person whoever you are getting in contact with I'm seeing the babies coming in beautiful babies beautiful um, babies because they're all from psychic families beautiful babies coming in some of you are seeing a situation and going to decide to leave the situation behind some of you have um, decided that the relationship that you're having with these fire sign people is no longer um, supporting your energy vibration and you have decided um, to leave it and then you have found someone new okay so um, this is good some of you um, are going to decide that okay um, my pregnancy or my expectancy has gone too far so I'm just gonna keep this baby and um, your partner whoever the person is is going to agree with you and um, this is going to become a beautiful relationship okay so um, I'm seeing a lot of men a lot of cancer men deciding to leave a situation I'm seeing cancer men over the age of 40 deciding to leave a situation um, leave a marriage leave a relationship that you're having with an Aries Leo or Sagittarius I'm seeing this happen where you're deciding um, no I am not doing this anymore I've, I've, I've met someone this is not your soulmate or your twin thing but a new love is coming in that you're going to decide this is the person I want to be with and this is the person I need in my life and you're going to decide um, to go with this person and um, it is going to be good it is going to be um, a very positive because what is going to be happening is that um, you're going to be aligned with the this relationship and um, as if with this relationship it's going to be helping you to move forward so I'm seeing some unity you have the energy of unity coming out in this week for you guys and this is very good whatever the situation is I'm seeing unity coming in and this is in a very wonderful and positive way whatever that has transpired whatever that has happened there is going to be finally unity in your life it's as if you decided no way this person is not going to take over my life totally I am NOT I've been trying to deal with the situation for quite some time and um, now I'm going to take back my and uh, empower myself okay and a lot of men a lot of you cancer men are going to decide to end a relationship and a lot of you are going to be um, meeting new people and the men and women are going to be new, meeting new people but the men especially the men you're going to just um, decided if you may men are in relationship that is so unbalanced or work situation that is so unbalanced you're going to decide I'm, I'm letting go of this situation and I'm going to move forward and I'm going to um, uh, 
find something else in my life you're going to decide just to move forward find something else in your life and just be happy um, moving forward okay because um, this is um, very positive for you and this is the best outcomes for you guys so I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being back namaste until next time